<clears throat> all right so what is good everybody on youtube it is your boy j three times we're back at it with another video in the building and today you guys we're going to talk about add-ons and differences between the marine corps uniforms now i want to talk about the marine corps uniforms i mean specifically like the uh, the dress blues or maybe maybe the service uniforms actually i'm not allowed to i'm specifically talking about the dress blue uniforms um because like i don't think there's really much differences actually there really is no differences with the utilities like the wooden utilities the desert utilities but you know you know i don't think even the service uniforms don't got much of a difference you know just the rankings it's like really the only di main difference but there are many differences and many add-ons to your dress blue uniforms and we're going to go over these differences and these add-ons as you increase in rank of course you're going to get like stuff added to your uniform that looks really cool and i'll give you one example that blush stripe that nco blush stripe that's a big big add-on right there when you're dressed blue uniform you know when you become corporal that's like a significant like a, a good change like i mean it, it feels good i'm not gonna lie to y'all it feels good you, you you get your uniform tailored you get your blood stripe you, you get that blood stripe going down your trousers man feels good man and also on the dress blue uniform you get promoted to corporal you know now I'm gonna I'm gonna put up pictures, you guys. I'm gonna put up pictures so you guys can tell the difference and you can see what I'm talking about. So like with Junior Marines, of course, you're gonna have like a plain gold belt buckle in the dress uniform, dress blue uniform, um, and also your trousers, just plain blue trousers. All right. When you become a corporal, you become an NCO, you get a red blush right on the side of your trousers and you get an EGA, an EGA belt buckle. It's real cool. It's a real nice add-on, y'all. You know, nice touch. I, I love how the Marine Corps does certain things. That's, I feel like that's why I went in the Marine Corps, y'all. I ain't gonna lie to you. I feel like that's why I went in the Marine Corps because it's, I don't know, it just fits so. I don't know, it just fits so good. Like the way they do things, the way they carry themselves, the way they act. Things. I don't know, yo. But um, another add-on too. Like I said, the dress blue uniform because that's really the main uniform that you can tell the differences in. Is um now another add-on is uh your reenlistment stripe. Now, of course, your reenlistment stripe, that's like definitely something you also get on your service uniform too. Your service that should that should be on your service alphas actually as well. But you should get a stripe every four years that you're in. So technically, I think I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to have a stripe in my um, dress blue uniform and my service uniforms because I've been in for four years. I've been in for over four years, actually. So I'm supposed to put a reenlistment stripe on there. So, yeah. But anyways, y'all, the next add-on. Now, this is just something. I don't think it's an add-on. It's just something that specifically officers have. This is the, uh, I don't know how to pronounce it. Don't make me look stupid, all right? All right. Today, Junior! The court foil. I think it's the court foil. I don't know how to say it. I don't know. The court foil. I, I might be saying it wrong. But, you know, something that is on uh, officers, you know, like, I think it's called a garrison cap. Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't know. The garrison cap. And a dress blue, you know, dress blue cover. You'll see on the top of the officer's cover is the like the little core foil. Now, the reason why officers have that little core foil, the, in the picture I'm showing y'all, the reason why for that is I, I looked it up. I'm pretty sure it was cause like, you know, um, it was like a thing back in the early days, the 1800s or something like that, 1700s, was like, that was the way, you know, snipers can tell, you know, those are, you know, officers, you know, though, though that, that's how like, you know, cause you know, obviously you're a sniper, you're going to be at a high distance at a far range. And how are you really going to be able to tell who's enemy and who's friendly, you know? So like that cast kind of like for officers, that was kind of like, they're like, 
that was the way, like the, the little core phone, that was like the symbol. That was the way to tell that they were officers. They were higher ups, they were friendlies, you know? So I, I, I'm pretty sure that that was like the back, that's the, that's the whole backstory for that, you know? But another add on, I think I got a little ahead of myself, of course. Well, not really, but anyways, the EGA on the belt buckle. Now, the EGA. Now, the cool the cool thing about the EGA on the belt buckle. Now, for the NCOs, the NCOs, they get a EGA in the belt. Now, now, PSC, private PSCs and Lance Corporals, they just get a plain gold belt buckle. Now, the Corporals and Sergeants, they get like a EGA on the belt buckle. Now, the staff NCOs and up. Your staff is that you know, staff stars and gunning stars and mass stars and all that. They get an EGA plus the little, the little flower. I don't know what the, the freaking flowers in on the sides of the EGA. I don't know what, what that is. I, I don't know what it's called. But yeah, you get a little, um, like I said, the add ons are kind of nice, y'all. You know what I'm saying? It's a little touch, you know, the staff into your belt buckle. It's cool, you know, that's another add on, you know. Um, this is not really an add on, this is just like a a difference in the uniform. The next one I'm getting to is the general black trousers. Now, I, I think those are cool. That 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 it's tough. Black trousers with that you know that um with that blood stripe. The general look cool. I, I ain't gonna lie, I look clean. I look clean. Black trousers. Um, another difference in the uh, Marine Corps uniform. I was had to say specifically the dress blues. Is the officers dress blues in general? Now, personally, comment down below, y'all. How y'all feel about this? The enlisted dress blues or the officers dress blues? Personally, me, I think the officers dress blues are way cleaner. They look way cleaner. I'm not gonna lie to you. I feel like I feel like if a general wore that with the black trousers, they wouldn't look so clean, you know. But you know, hey, with the, no, the white trousers or the blue trousers, they ain't like blue trousers or the white trousers look clean. I like the black trousers with the um, the black top or blue, whatever you call it, it's too much, you know, but yeah, the officer dressed loose. That's a, that's a different, definitely a different, whole different uniform. Now, oh yeah, I forgot the last one I have here for y'all. The officer's dress blue cover. Now I'm not gonna, well, this is kind of like the same thing for, um, kind of like, you know, the little belt buckle with the, um, the, you know, the belt buckle kind of thing. It's kind of like a similar thing, but it's, except it's with a cover for the officers. So now like, it's cool. Cause like, here's how it goes, you know, with the ranking for the, um, you know how the junior marines, there's NCOs, so your junior marines, your privates, PFCs, lance corporals, your NCOs, or corporals, or sergeants, your staff NCOs, or staff non commissioned officers, in other words, or your staff sergeants, gunnery sergeants, master sergeants, and on. Now, how it works with the officer's ranks. Uh, this, this, I believe it's second lieutenant, first lieutenant, and the captain. Those are your company grade officers. Now, next you get to your field grade officers, which are your majors, lieutenant, colonels, and your colonels. Now you get to your general officers. So it goes from company, uh, company grade officer, field grade officer, general officers. Now your general officers, of course, your brigadier general, major general, lieutenant general, and you just your general, the four star generals. So now we got to that. Now with the covers, when, when so the covers, the cover changes as you increase like, you know, what section, I guess, I don't know how, how, what what to define that company grade, what, what section, I guess. The dress blue cover changes. It's tough. I'm gonna put up pictures for you. I'm gonna put up pictures so you can look at the differences. It's tough. They add on this little, um, this thing on their cover. It's like, um, see like a listed, dang, I don't got my cover on me. But like, you see like, you can tell the difference between the, the enlisted dress blue cover and the officer dress blue cover. You see the difference. Cause like the enlisted, they got the little black thing right there. But the officer, they had like the little, the little band on the top of their joint right there. See now, now of course, company gray officers got the little yellow band. The field gray officers, they got the little, 
the little flower stuff. I don't know what the little flower stuff on top of their stuff. You feel me? And then in the, in the generals, they got dang, what was it? I don't know. I forgot. But yeah, it looks it looks cool. I feel like the add-ons like that, that's what's so cool about the Marine Corps and uniforms, man. Marine Corps now do it. And Marine Corps know how to look clean. They know how to look sharp. They they they, they know how to present themselves. No cap. Yeah, man. Anyways, y'all, I think that's it. There might be more add-ons, more differences in Marine Corps uniforms. That's just, you know, um, some stuff I'll give y'all right there. Uh, there might be more than it might be. Uh, I don't know. But that's just from me, you know, um, from what I know, from what I remember, you know. Um, yeah, anyways, y'all, like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more content. Stay humble, stay motivated, stay positive. Stay inspired. Keep doing your thing. All that good trash. I'm checking out. Peace.